in this video I want to show you a helpful plugin for your WordPress website that will help you to redirect all the 404 pages to your home page and that's good for SEO and it also provides a better user experience for your website visitors because nobody likes it when you go to a page that is not available and you see an error message or something like that so in this case if a wrong URL is being added to the browser then automatically it will redirect back to the home page the way to go is first you have to go to the plugins option over here so click on plugins then you have to click on the add new button over here so click on it and the plugin that we need is called all 404 redirect so search for all 404 redirect and then you have to make sure to select this one by WP by it has over 200,000 active installations and it's compatible with your version of WordPress over here you can see last updated one month ago so that's also good to see so click on install now to install the plugin wait for a couple of seconds and once it's done you can click on the blue activate button Now you can see that the plugin has been added to the list of all the plugins that I have installed for this website. So now you can go to the settings option. So click on it. And you can leave everything on the default settings. But over here you can see the 404 redirection status is enabled. So that's good because then you know that it works. You can see that all the pages, all the 404 pages will redirect to this URL. So that's the URL of the homepage in this case. You can see staging too because this is a staging website. But if that's not the case, then this will be deleted and then it's just a regular URL of the website. And over here you can see some other information. You can leave everything as it is. And now, we'll sh and now we will show you how it works. So to show you, I will go back to the plugins overview. Now I will deactivate this plugin. So it's not longer active. Now I'm going to enter a URL that does not exist and then we'll see what happens. Over here you can see the incognito tab. So now I'll just enter the URL that I have just copied followed by something that does not exist. So just some random characters. Click on enter. Now you can see this message. This page can be found. It looks like nothing was found at this location. So this is the error message that I was talking about earlier in this video. And this offers not a good experience for the users of your website and also as I mentioned it is not good for SEO because Google will recognize this and this can impact your ranking so now I'm gonna activate the plugin and now you can see that the plugin has been activated there was one thing I want to mention that I forgot earlier and that is if I go back to the settings option so click on it you can see this notification you have a cache plugin installed and then you have to clear cache after any changes to get the changes reflected immediately so if you do any changes over here at the settings which i won't recommend you to do then you have to make sure to clear the cache for this website i have also made other videos about that how you can do that so if you don't know how to do that make sure to check them out but now let me go back to the incognito tab again and now if I enter some random digits again like this now I'll hit enter and now you can see that it redirects back to the home page of the website and that's what you want so everything works fine that's what you need to know so it's a very easy to use plugin which has a great effect so my advice will be to download it and install it for your website if you haven't done already. So if you found this video helpful, make sure to let me know by smashing the thumbs up. Also subscribe to the channel if you haven't done already. And also hit the notification bell if you want to stay up to date on new videos that I will be uploading. 
If you have any questions, make sure to let me know in the comment section and I will do my best to answer all your questions. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a nice day and I'll see you back again in the next video.